everyone. In this tutorial video, we'll discover features for Cassia. Part 1. Local Server If the restaurant is applying offline working mode before opening the first shift of a day, the cashier needs to turn on Cook Cook Server so that all devices can get connected and synchronized to the local server. In case of online working mode, enter restaurant name here and click OK. Enter username and passwords to log in. To log in with offline working mode, enter IP address. Then, enter username and password to log in. Part 2. Login Open Shift Log in to Cuckoo Sales Software. Then, Open Shift window will pop up and the staff should enter required information and click Open Shift to start working. Close Shift In the end of a shift, the staff log out of the program to close shift. The program will show shift report including total sales and items sold in a shift. You can bring the minutes for archive or click close shift. Part 3 Layout and Audio Interface On the program, the staff can select interface by layout or by order. With order interface, the program will show all orders being served in the restaurant and classify into four statuses Waiting for payment, takeaway, delivery, and reservation. In this interface, the staff can easily manage orders. The staff can quickly check out, edit order, check item, or proceed with other actions. With layout interface, the staff can easily know the quantity and status of all tables in the restaurant. Quickly check the quantity of available tables in the restaurant and arrange tables for the guest. Blue means available, while gray means being served or reserved. Click on the tables and proceed with actions you want. Pass 4. Select table and take order. Click add order and search items organized by category. Click on the menu bar to search items by ID or their initials. When there's any error, click on X mark to remove item from order. For items which have been sent to the kitchen or the bar, delete them here. To remove order, select Delete Order. During taking order, the guest may give special request. Click on the item and select modifiers. If the request is new, the staff can add it by selecting modifier on the item and then clicking plus button. Click OK to confirm. To add notes for the kitchen or bar, select quick note and enter request. Remember that this notes will not be saved for next times. Select to adjust price of applicable items. Click OK to apply new price. If the restaurant is running a promotion program, click on promotion to select. If the restaurant allows to serve items out of menu, the staff can recognize the items by selecting add other item. Enter item information and click OK to confirm. Select a table, number of guests, and click Send to Kitchen Bar. When adding new order, the program will default as Diane. To select other serving type, click on the arrow and select Takeaway, Delivery, or Reservation. 
the stock and chain serving type of orders which is being taken or have been taken by clicking on the order information icon. Selecting serving type, enter information and click OK. Part 5. Reservation Book If there is any reservation, the staff selects Add Reservation, enter time, table, name and phone number of the guest. Then click Save. All reserved tables are managed in the Reservation Book. Click to edit reservation or delete to cancel reservation. Part 6. Change table or move item to other order. On order screen, the staff clicks on the order to move. Click here and select change table. Or select order to move and enter table number on search bar. Click save to save changes. To move item to other order, click here. Enter quantity to move, select order and click OK. To move item to new order, select here and click OK. Part 7. Split order or combine orders. If the guests want to check out separately, the staff will split the order and browse it with payment for each guest. Click on the order to be split and select split order. Check split each item into one order. Or the staff can split as below. Each order must include at least one item. Click OK to complete. If the guest wants to combine orders to make payment once, Go to Order to be combined and select Combine Orders. The staff select Orders to be combined and click OK. The program will combine orders with table numbers. Part 8. Get Payment or Offer Promotion Quickly select Check Out on Order. Or select Order and click Check Out. Select guest information from the list of guests on the program or quickly add guests if the guest is new. Check promotion program applicable to the order. If the restaurant is used vouchers, select voucher and enter voucher ID. Click OK to apply. If the restaurant allows the staff to apply other promotions, the staff can add promotion to apply to the whole bill or to each item. Check service charge and enter amount if any. Check include tax if applicable. To print check, click here and set bills at drop here. Click get payment and select payment method by cash or bank card as set on the management page. If the guest tips, check this box. Finally, click print and accept to finish payment and print bill for the guest. If the guest makes payment with multiple methods, enter amount corresponding to each method. To give a credit to the guest, check here. Check change deducted to offer the guest change. Then, click print and accept. When a guest wants to pay debt, go to Collect Debt. Enter guest name to search. Click here to collect debt and select payment method. Check bill to collect debt if the guest wants to pay by bill. Payable debt will be shown here. If the guest wants to pay a certain amount, enter amount here. Then the program will automatically allocate paid amount to bills. Click OK to confirm. Part 9. List of bills. If any bill is missing, the staff can print it again as below. Open list of bills. Select to search by date or status. Double click on the bill to be reprinted and select print. 
In case of editing or canceling any bill, to edit or delete bill, the program will require manager to confirm. After logging in successfully, select Edit to change bill information and payment method. Select Delete to remove bill from the list. Part 10. Add and edit menu. If a cashier is assigned to work with the menu, on auto screen, select menu. They can add, edit, or delete item here. The program shows available food or drink items in the restaurant. To add new item, click add and enter item information. The fields with star red mark are required. Add modifiers if any, click Save to finish. For existing items, click on them to edit. After that, click Save. Part 11. View Shift Report Select General Report Select to view Shift Report the program will show total sales, deposits, and debt payments. View report on detailed sales by item here. The staff can print or export to Excel file to report to managers. Report on quantity of processed or returned item helps the manager find out reason when there's any difference between the quantity of processed item and that on the bill. Report is made by day. You can click on item name to check details by bill. Above are features for cashiers should know and process.